Hello everyone, and this is Tamar Rothenberg here and Empowering Woman. And today I want to talk about changes. Yes, changes. Why are we so afraid of changing, you know, of changes in our hair? So as you see, I post many different posts about my hair. I'm starting just to change it a little bit, a little bit curly because it's the end of the summer. Sometimes when we do any changes in our lives, we are so much afraid. Why? Why is that that we are afraid of? Uh, what is it that keep our attention to be afraid of changes? Like if I change my hairstyle, people won't like to me anymore. People will look at me different. They'll think something is happening to me. Um, why uh, people is afraid about changing? Why we are so used to be in comfortable mode? And what is the relation between changes and 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 uh, comfort zone? So. Is changes related to get out of your comfort zone? Of course, we need to change to be out of our comfort zones every time, every now and then. As long as we are comfortable again, we have to change again to be, to push ourselves out of the comfort zone. So that's what I wanted to talk about. I wanted to talk about some changes. Sometimes it's very difficult to start doing some changes or maybe the changes are happening to us even if we, don't, we are not planning. I mean, sometimes, you know, we're getting into situations in our lives, sad situations, happy situations. We, we have to move from a, an apartment to a house or a house to an apartment. You know, we have to, de de depending on the stage of our lives. And I think once you, you start leaving the changes more like relax and more like, okay, this life is for me to change and to grow, um, you start receiving all these changes in a good, positive way. Of course, we don't like changes in general, right? Depending on the change. For example, the kids are changing the school. It's difficult to them to adjust, new friends, new environment. We change the job. Also, it's difficult when you start a new job. I don't think it's easy. Any change is easy, but that's the point, right? If it's easy, it won't be like a good change for you. I think we get more gratification when we struggle with changes and we have to wish and hope for new changes in our life, for good changes in our lives. And if it's okay if we fail, it's okay if we feel a little bit uncomfortable, that's part of our, of our lives. So I want you to put in the comments below, what changes in your life make you say this, without this change I wouldn't be the same. I wouldn't be the same person if I didn't have this change in my life. This change of a job, this change, this change because it happens to me. Uh, this maybe, it, it could be something happy, it could be something sad, it could be something, you know. But a change itself. So I want that you comment me below to see what changes do you face. I face changes every day in my life. And I, I try to see the positive sides of the changes, although I won't lie to you sometimes and say, what is this? going on what I have so many changes in my life but I try to look at the positive way and say you know with the changes we grow and it's good because if everything will be the same it will be so so boring so we need changes we need to work on changes we need to grow with changes and this is Tamar Rothenberg here in Empowering Woman and my life coach I'm here for you bye bye